Jim, another heartbreaking defeat for the Saints in a knockout game. Um, what do these games come down to in the end? It comes down to, um, I guess, a few referee decisions, a few key decisions, um, and ultimately we just didn't get that today. We, we came close, we played well, um, Ryan Lamb kicked a lot of goals and scored a cracking try, but in the end we just didn't get enough to get over the line. When you produce a try like that in such a tight game, is there ever a point where you feel maybe it's going to be your day? Well, you always hope that it's going to be your day, but you, you, you've got to just always play the full 80 minutes. And uh, we're into a bit of a breeze, so it's always going to be hard that second half. Um, and I guess when we're eight points up, we just need a little bit more accuracy to get out of our half and put them under a bit more pressure. In a season that's had so many mitigated factors, internationals, injuries, suspensions, is there any way you can take any sort of pride from reaching this semi-final? I think we take a lot of pride from doing that and uh, I think you know, early on in during the World Cup when we're a second from bottom then uh, would have taken you know, getting out at this stage. So it, it, it's been an up and down season without a doubt but we're learning all the time, we're getting better. To be involved in these semi-finals is only good for the club, it's only good for the younger players. If you look at the team that finished today, you know, you look at the forwards in particular, we had lots of young forwards here who have hardly played any Premiership games and the experience of playing in a game like this will stand us uh, as a club in good stead. Side have shown in the past that they can come back from the disappointment and just keep doing it over again. What, what does that take? Um, I think that's a team that we've got and we've got a really good uh, core of players and we're disappointed that we're going to lose certain of them. James Downey, Roger Wilson, absolutely outstanding today and, and through the years that they've been here. But the club progresses and moves on and we've got some very exciting young new players arriving at the club and I think we'll only get stronger as we move forward. And just on a final word, when you look back at 2011-12 as a season, what would be your overall reaction? Um, I, I, you've caught me in a bit of a raw state at the moment, to be honest, because it's a little bit disappointing getting straight out of the semi-final. But we'll look back and we've certainly had some highs, we've had some great times and we've had a few lows and uh, I guess that's what professional rugby is all about.